hey guys good luck for your maths exam today um this is a big one but you can do this i 100 percent believe in you really important things for you to remember are that prim believes in you as well um you need to reset your calculator before the exam this is really really important because um, it's only a teeny tiny little letter thing that tells you which mode your calculator is in. So you want to make sure that it's in the right one so that when you do trigonometry and do any assumptions, you're not getting the wrong answer. So reset your calculator like the night before, just before you go into the exam. Think about starting the paper at the back. The back has the harder questions, so this is a really, really long exam. If you do the hardest questions when you've been working for an hour, hour and a half, you're going to be tired, your brain's going to be tired, you're not going to want to, your brain's not going to want to do really, really hard maths, basically. So start the paper at the back. Do the hard questions when your brain is fresh, when you're alert, um, and don't worry if you don't get all the hard questions. These are the hardest questions on the paper. Even if you can just start the questions, get a couple of lines down, that's going to be really, really good marks for you. And then as you go through the paper, the paper will get easier. So the paper will get easier as you go along, which is not the way that the papers are written. So it's going to be a lovely, refreshing thing. You can start with hard questions and then get to the easy questions at the end. And then if you do the easy questions, the nice, short, multiple choice questions, after an hour, hour and a half you put in the exam, your brain's going to appreciate it because your brain's been working really, really hard. So I know you have been slogging for quite a while now. We are nearly at the end. We've come so, so far. Um, you are doing absolutely fantastic work. I'm so proud of each and every single one of you. Please come back after the exam and let me know down in the comments how it went. Um, if there are any questions you didn't understand, describe them in as much detail as you can and I'll try and work out um, the answers for you um good luck guys i will be thinking about you all while you are in the exam ouch this is why in some videos i have unexplained scratches